Two at six, 25 pheasants were released into the wild by a group trying to reintroduce them into the area. WSBT 22's Patrick Roth is here, and Patrick, pheasants used to be fairly common here. Yeah, Jennifer, about 50 years ago, this wouldn't have been that big of a deal, but the population has been decimated over the years by things like urban sprawl, industrialization of farming, and also several harsh winters. And this group is working to change all that. Years ago, this would have been a pretty common sight. Pheasants in their natural habitat, in the prairie. Pheasants were very common here until the uh, early 70s, actually. Uh, and then some severe winters uh, in uh, 78 and 79 pretty much decimated their populations. Those winters combined with the loss of their natural habitat all but destroyed a once thriving pheasant population. And that's where the group Pheasants Forever comes in, by restoring more than 30 acres of old farmland in the prairie. There's prairie grasses, wildflowers planted here. Uh, this is the type of habitat they require to have the food and, uh, and most importantly, the shelter and the protection against predators uh, for them to be able to uh, thrive. After a couple of years with disappointing results, the group is trying a new tactic to reintroduce pheasants into the wild. Instead of releasing them and leaving them on their own, the group will ease the birds back into the wild. To come up with a new way to, to, to put a pan out in the wild and get the birds to... Uh, get acclimated to the wild and we're gonna we're just gonna let them kind of ease out takes a while because they're used to being they're used to being fed you know so this is a little different new stuff that we come up with and while there's still a lot of hard work left for the pheasants there are a lot of animals that are benefiting from the hard work done around here all the habitat helps the deer the rabbits the, the songbirds and the bees we all <laughs> live on this earth and I think anything we can do to uh, maintain and improve uh, this type of environment is, is important to everybody. Now the main problem the pheasants are going to face out in the wild is there's a lot of predators out there. Back when pheasants were more common, the presidents were actually much more likely to wind up getting shot by people. And Jennifer, we have much more information, including a link to this organization's website, on our website at WSBT.com.